Well, you know um, what? I am very glad you have received your console, Sarah, because... Uh, I did! And it, I did tell, tell people I got it. A very... I don't want to name him to, like, out him, but a very good friend <laughs> of mine sold it to me. He ended up not needing it, and I got it. So I got one. It is safe here. I'm looking at it right now. And I am done. I am saved. <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, all good. Uh, Others are not so fortunate. In an unfortunate turn of news, uh, the completely benevolent overlord and savior of the human race, uh, Amazon slash Jeff Bezos, has uh, sent a slew of emails to a number of customers informing them that the plastic ambrosia... Why the fuck did I write that? That is so pretentious. I was looking at it, yeah. Damn. What the fuck was I thinking? (laughs) Anyway, their Xbox Series Xs will remain out of their... God, oh, why did I write that? I mean, you and I went to the same film school, but no one ever used the word ambrosia when I you was. You know what, it. dude? I got exclusively A pluses on my papers, and this is exactly I mean, how I wrote. Time, I never used the word ambrosia. <laughs> I was I was listening to a lot of Alisana. Okay. Nice. Yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> uh, fuck. Okay, ignoring my writing here, I, I I need to keep my news article writing very separate from my show notes. <laughs> Righty, those are two very different things. Um, fuck. Let's just go from the top. Amazon has sent out emails to those that have that have pre-ordered Xbox Series Xs, and uh, saying, "Sorry, you might get them as late as December thirty first, which would be." So, are uh, these new pre pre-orders, or are these no, the older ones? These are the original pre-orders that from back in. Because I got mine day one. You are very lucky, then. You got lucky. <laughs> Like, I got mine day one, and I have friends who also ordered from Amazon who got theirs either day one or around day day one. So I don't know what the fuck they're doing. <laughs> Corporate overlord uh, Jeff Bezos shines upon you. <laughs> He's blessed you with Prime. Ew, I don't want Jeff Bezos to fuck <laughs> me with anything. <laughs> if if you buy an Amazon gift card, why don't they just call it, like, Bezos Bucks? Don't give yeah. them any ideas. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I, we, we can talk about this later when we discuss what we're playing, but I'm pr- playing Outer Worlds right now, and I'm pretty convinced at this point that the writers from Obsidian just looked at Amazon and were like, yeah, that. That'll, that'll be Amazon that's in like five mm-hmm. years. <laughs> just know, yeah, it doesn't make any sense to me because Amazon seemed really on top of it when I pre-ordered my X, X, Xbox. They were able to let me know when it was shipping out, when I was going to be charged... They pretty much knew, so I don't know either. I just got really lucky, and I got in the like first wave to where they were just able to like ship them out with no problem. But it's or it's also showing the fact that Microsoft doesn't have enough consoles. Yeah, it's probably yeah. I mean, I think like, what Amazon might have done in this instance is that they were taking orders without necessarily having that stock, because they assumed that they would be getting more. Hmm. I mean, that's that but also like the fact because like, I don't know when I called them asking about buy stock, like all those weeks ago, the person was pretty much able to like get a hold and tell me that they hadn't received them yet, but that they got them the next day. Like it was like this weird. I don't I don't know. I feel like none of this is the like, they, like yeah, some of this is the shop's fault because they're selling too many pre pre orders. But at the same time, I also feel like a lot of it's more production fault that they're just not making enough, which then could be led back to it's COVID's fault. We don't know. <laughs> Just passing mm. the ball. That's the other thing. <laughs> that's all that's happening right now. 